District authorities imposed a ban on the movement and consumption of livestock following the confirmation of an anthrax outbreak. Initially suspected to be a different livestock disease, the district has now confirmed an outbreak. It has been confirmed that we are dealing with the threat of an anthrax disease, both in animals and in human beings. The number of animals so far infected has raised from uh, 63 at the beginning of the week to now 79. Uh, the number of human beings infected has also grown to 33. At the beginning of the week, there were about 28. We have so far had three fatalities. According to the World Health Organization, anthrax is a zoonotic disease, meaning it can be transmitted from animals to humans. Humans can become infected if they handle or are involved in the slaughter of a sick animal. It can also infect those who come into contact with contaminated animal products such as meat, blood, wool, hides, bones, among others. Residents have been urged to follow guidelines which include a three-month quarantine and the ban of red meat cells and livestock movement within and outside the district. In addition, all animals in the district will be vaccinated to prevent further spread of the disease. The security committee, when they sat and the technical team, decided to put in place a quarantine, looking at how quickly this, the disease was being spread. So I appeal to the people of Kanungu to make sure that they, they respect those strict measures which have been put in place. The restrictions have impacted the local economy in Kanungu, especially businesses that rely on the sale of meat and livestock products such as hotels and catering services. Some businesses have turned to selling chicken, but operators say the profit margins are much lower. To the extent that some of us actually are now failing to get what to sell. At least when we, there was some um, goats meat and cows meat, we used it to save at least like 20k what? But now, with this new business of selling the chicken, man, it's not easy. A small piece of roasted chicken goes for 4,000 shillings, while a stick of roasted beef was 1,000 shillings. So people are not buying, they are used to beef prices. 